Hello! I would like to welcome all the listeners and thank you for tuning in to this Talking Cheap Radio. My name is Sean Ennis and today we have a superb show for you. Just a reminder, if you've not already, please go to and subscribe to the YouTube channel at Ennis Productions. Ennis Productions is your source for music, business, motivation, and support. And we also have the Creative Collective series where we interview talented people and give them a chance to share their story. So for today, for music news, Alamo Records has hired J.R. Mickey as head of digital sales and revenue. Mickey will oversee the streaming strategy and marketing for the label, in addition to interfacing with Alamo's DSP partners. Alamo Records is industry veteran Todd Moskowitz's latest venture. Founded in partnership with Universal Music Group in early 2017. The label has seen early successes with acts such as Lil Durk, Black Bear, and Smoke Perp, among others. During the last two decades, Moskowitz has signed and worked with artists ranging from Action Bronson to Meek Mill, Mike Jones, Gucci Mane, Young Thug, Jill Scott, Macklemore, and record labels OVO Sound and Maybach Music Group. Before launching Elmo Records in 2013, Moskowitz co-founded 300 Entertainment, a New York-based independent company that signed, developed, and broke artists such as Fetty Wap, Highly Suspect, and Migos. Spotify has launched a new personalized playlist that combines podcasts and music. The new playlist currently only for U.S. users, is called Your Daily Drive and has been launched alongside Spotify's new Driving Hub. As first reported by The Verge, Spotify started testing inserting podcasts into personalized playlists earlier this year. At launch, the new playlist will feature short-form podcast news updates from the likes of The Wall Street Journal, NPR, and PRI, and updates throughout the day to keep both the music and news fresh. The new in-car focused playlist follows last month's news that Spotify is testing a voice controlled in-car audio device in the US called CarThing. According to a blog post published on May 17th, Spotify says that the test will be carried out in the US only with a small group of invited Spotify premium users. So this is certainly something very interesting. Spotify continues to push the envelope in terms of what they provide using all the massive amount of influence they have of being, you know, arguably the biggest streaming platform in the world today. So certainly this is something to keep an eye on. All right, let's get into some music. I'm bam bam. You ain't gotta say shit, bitch. I'm too turned. What's another tool work, nigga? Who first? Oh, baby, niggas better let me shoot first. Better die for the deck, but the true dirt. Push your bitch on the ass, what your boo worth? Slap that bitch on the ass, make her do dirt. Get some ass, get some cash, chuck the new skirt. Hug a whole little cheeks like my tooth hurt. Then I'm finna hit the trap, get these bags off. And bitch, you finna hit the track, but that ass cost. Give me my fan, tryna hit your ass talk. Watch every new trying finna get his blast off. Catch the I be doing sloppy dance, smash off. On the corners, out the corner, get him dragged off. Set the subject head up and tore his ass off. Bitch, that bitch in 2020 like mad dog. For my brothers, man, you know I'm gon' rock. It's go time and you know I'm gon' slap. I keep about 50 niggas outside. This year when I got the hitters outside. And for my brothers, man, you know I'm gon' rock. It's go time and you know I'm gon' slap. I keep about 50 niggas outside. This year when I got the hitters outside. And for my brothers, man, you know I'm gon' rock. It's go time and you know I'm gon' slap. I keep about 50 niggas outside. This year when I got the hitters outside. And for my brothers, man, you know I'm gon' rock. It's go time and you know I'm gon' slap. I keep about 50 niggas outside. This year when I got the hitters 
outside. outside. Shift this package off FedEx. Don't need a CNA when you're a bad rap. Chopper bullets hit his whole body in a pussy bus. Still ain't dead yet. Shoot a shooter like Chill Will. He thought I wouldn't shoot it till I shot his chest. And I'm a roller bitch and I rep the West. It's time to call the rep so he can bring the tech. Shit's real in this fucking field. You try to play me, nigga, you gon' get killed. My gun bust in couples, nigga. Your shells gon' ride and be the fifth wheel. I rob your ass with your big wheels and show your ass how that shit feel. Yeah, I rob your ass with your big wheels and show your ass how that shit feel. The mask up and put the mask on. The haters try to flesh, gon' get blasted on. I pray to me like you pray to Jesus. Homicidal flow is killing season. Slave a nigga, knock him out his boots. And they will tell me like you played a role on roots. Crazy nigga that's down to shoot. I got killers whipping, don't make me let him loose. And keep the cold on me, boy, I ain't running. Get the head hunt when the opps start ducking. They talk a beef shit, boy, it's nothing. Shots ring off, nigga, start running. I bust your brain if you fuck with you, honey. I hit your block with the chop, start drumming. I hit your block with the chop, start drumming. Bitch, I hit the block with the chop, start drumming. For my brothers, man, you know I'm gon' ride. It's no time, and you know I'm gon' slide. I keep about 50 niggas outside. They scared when I got the hitters outside. And for my brothers, man, you know I'm gon' ride. It's go time, and you know I'm gon' slide. I keep about 50 niggas outside. They scared when I got the hitters outside. And for my brothers, man, you know I'm gon' ride. It's go time, and you know I'm gon' slide. I keep about 50 niggas outside. They scared when I got the hitters outside. And for my brothers, man, you know I'm gon' ride. It's go time, and you know I'm gon' slide. I keep about 50 niggas outside. They scared when I got the hitters outside. Tsunami, splash, ooh, check out my swag, swag, yeah, look at my swag, swag, yeah, making them mad, oh, yeah, all in my bag, oh, yeah, wave, tsunami, splash, ooh, wave, tsunami, splash, ooh, check out my swag, oh, yeah, look at my swag, oh, yeah, making them mad, oh, yeah, all in my bag, oh, yeah. Man, I've been jigging for days, yeah. I'm out here trying to get paid. Hey, hey to stay out of my way. Uh, bury them all in the grave. Work overtime, do it for the flip. I be in my bag, sour cream. Do it for the chips. Under, 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 lay for. What the, what they in the way for? Give them, give them what they paid for. Give them, give them what they came for. I want the house with the maid, yeah. Michael Jordan with the fade. Uh, I turn into a tsunami. Uh, they cannot control the wave. Wave. Tsunami, splash, ooh, ooh, wave, tsunami, splash, ooh, check out my swag, oh, yeah, look at my swag, swag, yeah, making them mad, oh, yeah, all in my bag, oh, yeah, wave, tsunami, splash, ooh, wave, tsunami, splash, ooh, check out my swag, oh, yeah, look at my swag, oh, yeah, making them mad, oh, yeah, all in my bag. Lottie, dotty, lottie, dotty, uh, you know that we came to party, yeah Used to pull up in the hootie, uh, now I pull off in the Rari, uh, I flood the city like FEMA, yeah After Hurricane Katrina, uh, tell me, tell me how you seen her, uh, I ain't feeling your demeanor, uh, I'm Larry Bird with the three, uh, they ain't got swagger like me, uh, let the dog up off the leash, uh, understand me, man, capiche, uh, keep your enemies close, cause fake friends wanna see you hurt, I be catching waves, splash, all I do is surf, wave, tsunami, splash, ooh, wave, tsunami, splash, ooh, check out my swag, yeah, look at my swag, yeah, making them mad, oh, yeah, all in my bag, oh, yeah, wave, tsunami, splash, ooh, wave, tsunami, splash, ooh, check out my swag, oh, yeah, look at my swag, oh, yeah, making them mad, oh, yeah, all in my bag, oh yeah. All right, welcome back. Now, Feature FM is a self service advertising platform for the music industry. It was created because the creators believed that every artist deserves to have their music heard by the right audience. While experiencing how the music industry is changing and the struggles that artists go through, they sought out to create something special that harmonizes with how music is experienced today. 
After creating a playlisting service as a fun side project, Lior Aharani teamed up with his brother Zahar to create a social streaming service that allows people to listen to streaming radio stations powered by their friends' music tastes. They knew that streaming services were the future and people were going to continue to consume music that was recorded and revenue was going to continue to grow. After experiencing many of the common challenges the streaming service faced, they realized that many artists continued to struggle with getting their music heard. So they decided that they needed to help artists promote music within their own streaming service. Feature FM was born with these principles in mind. Every artist should have a fair access to airplay in front of the right audience. Artists with great music deserve to be discovered. Artists should be able to make a living off their music. So check out feature.fm. It's a great service to help you as an artist get your music in front of your audience. All right, here's some more music. I'm in the 
kulenga na nes gaji luto dolo lo ba fetung kulenga tse kokwa skisa umto ho la yase lo nkipa mahis begum nadi olo lo now speed of bus lem niggas they don't know kulenga na nes eh dolo lo kulenga na nes dolo lo kulenga na lu eh dolo lo Kulenga na next, dolo lo. Kulenga na next, gani luto dolo lo. Eka ya ba fetu kunti, ogwa skisa umto ho. O mama aga sebe story only God knows. O baba reska chisoka, I let you next see for genda. My mama was there to support us. All of my sister believe in me. I told her my mama I hustle. Mommy told me I should go to school. We don't work this for the education, education, education success. I didn't like nigga go to school. I thought I was a real fool. Work this so cool. All of me think I can do. Cause I really, really got the truth. Hey, there's no one but Jelly Mona. They really, really got me in the corner. They wishing me I'd have been no coma. Now I'm signing to the sign a contract. Started bottom, now I'm getting there. All I want to hear the ear is Hit me up, placing all my peers Do good things while he's making J's I'm a trapper with a serious mission All I want to be my mama and shit Making money wasn't me my dishes Making music, trying to get a tissue Hit us busy, making education Kulenga na nes, gali luto dolo lo Bafetu mkulenga tse, kokwa skisa umto ho La yase lo nkipa mahis, begu mnandi olo lo Now I'm speed of bus, lame niggas, they don't know Nkulenga na next, eh, dolo lo Nkulenga na next, dolo lo Nkulenga na lo, eh, dolo lo Nkulenga na next, dolo lo I've been dancing for some days No, please make it wait I'm really gotta get a pay To my family, nigga, I had a struggle Give me strength, I can keep the hustle I pray day, hell, I'm ready, baby My father left me while I still a kid We hardly speak, cause it's just a freak The time I left, I was crying for weeks My sister told me that I'm not alone This is the time when she whipped all the family Tied it up, but they said I said take our energy After yes, I was sipping the Hennessy I just wanna become a celebrity Love on my devil, live for all my enemies Damn I'm still young, chasing dreams Remember time, nigga, bitch, in school I was watching rest, watching rest in hands Got the answer, what you think it was I was under pressure, what you getting better With respect, a nigga, throw that swagger Believe me, nigga, I know the hunger pain I know the pain, know the nigga way Being poor, can't hold me back They said, but can I let go away like it? Tell the next year, ain't getting nothing Tell them, partner, I was chasing Zaga Now I'm fine, cause I'm moving forward I got my mama and my nigga friend We struggle together, we gon' reach together You just trash it and I'm getting fresh Kulenga na nes, gali luto dolo lo Bafetu mkulenga tse, kokwa skisa umto ho La yase lo nkipa mahis, begu mnandi olo lo Now I'm speed of bus, lem niggas they don't know Kulenga na nes, eh, dolo lo Kulenga na nes, dolo lo Kulenga na lo, eh, dolo lo Kulenga na nes, dolo lo All right, and we're back to this Talking Cheap Radio. And in this portion of the show, we'd like to welcome in our guests. Why don't you share your name and what you're all about for the listeners? Hey, Sean. Uh, I'm Paulina Evers. I'm a singer-songwriter from Charlotte, North Carolina. So, can you talk about how you initially got your start in music? Initially, I, I started by playing electric guitar and fell in love with that. Um, was heavily influenced by Jimi Hendrix at a very young age, um, kind of fell into that sort of uh, psychedelic style songwriting, and, uh, and, and that gradually uh, kind of uh, matured into the artist I am today. But um, that's kind of where I started, was with, was with Jimi Hendrix and guitar solos and electric guitar. Wow, that's so interesting. And and are you are you self taught as far as playing the guitar? Yes, I am totally self taught. Um, I I I wish I had some professional training, but um, but but I haven't as of as of now. 
And do you play any other instruments? Yeah, I, um, I've got a ukulele. I love to mess around with percussion um, as far as cajon. And I can, I can mess around on the drum kit a little bit. Um, really anything. I was playing a kalimba yesterday that my friend got. It's pretty fun. Um, any, any kind of instruments, really. But, um, but yeah, string instruments are probably my forte. Now let's talk about your single from here. Can you okay. kind of take me through um, the making of that song and what that song's about? Yeah. So from here, uh, that was that was a really cool experience. I was in a I was in my friend's shed. He's got a shed out back, and he's got a drum kit in there, and it's just kind of a spot to go to go just just play music and and. Um, and jam, if you will. Um, so we were out there um, one night, and we were just kind of messing around. I opened up my phone, um, opened up some lyrics that I had, and and I told him to just kind of um, improvise and just play something. And I wanted to try and just try and fit something together. And um, and we did that, and and actually we came up with like three really solid. Uh, songs and from here was one of those um, so it happened very organically and it was it was awesome a really cool experience um, but as soon as I heard it it was just it was just like a feeling when we listened back to it later we were like damn this feels this kind of feels like a hit you know and it's just like we, we both got really excited and I haven't really felt that before um, so yeah it just something spoke to us it was like yeah so from there I built on that and um, kind of made it my own a little bit and I've actually got Luke Sofer the original uh, uh, guy that I that I wrote the song with uh, uh, on the produced version uh, on the studio version so so that's really fun it's it's been a journey um, and we've got a really good finished product now and what's some of the themes or topics that you cover on the song? In the song, I, I, it's, it's, I don't want to say it's a love song. It's really more about um, things not working out uh, with someone you might, you may have thought they would, uh, and you just you just don't know where to go from here. That's actually you know one of the lines of the song. Um, but it, it's kind of just kind of like internal conflict, um, um, for lack of better words, you know, it's just kind of explaining internal conflict. Um, and, and yeah, it's, it's a little sad, but it's, uh, but that's what makes it soulful. How would you describe your music? I would describe my music as soulful and passionate um, because I don't I don't believe in just just uh, singing unless you are soulful or passionate about it um, you got to convey that so what would you say makes you different from other artists I think I'm different from other artists because I, I try to stay true to myself and I'm really really trying to, to convey that feeling that I was just talking about, the, um, that, that passion. Um, it's something real that you, it's, it's kind of intangible. It's, it's that, yeah, real passion and, 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 uh, and feeling through music. Um, making sure that comes through in my music, for sure. What are your music career goals? My music career goals. One th one goal that I just made uh, last month. I really want to. I don't know if I either tour with him or open the show for him or whatever. But I would really like to meet Omar Apollo. I think he's awesome and I love everything he's about. I love his music and um, so that's one goal. But as far as long term, um, I just want to be able to to um, convey that passion and that emotion on a, on a wide, wide scale. Um, and I do believe that it's possible. So. And what is it about 
Omar Apollo that sticks out or resonates with you? All he has to do is, you know, anyone can, can say they sing. They can call themselves a singer. But it's, it's the feeling you get when they start singing. Um, and he definitely, he definitely uh, conveys that feeling that I keep going back to. I keep saying that. But he, he has something to offer. You know, he's not just, um, he, he really feels it. And I think that's so important. Um, yeah, it's almost like it's just something you can't see. It's, it's intangible. And it's just, yeah, I love the feeling that his music gives me. And I can tell he means every word. So. What is one thing that you love and one thing that you absolutely hate about the music industry? One thing that I hate about the music industry is, uh, is, is all the politics um, um, as far as um, people, people want to do things to press the envelope, but a lot of times it's negative. And for some reason, that sells. Um, negative sells today, and I and I hate that. Um, something that I love about the music industry, sheesh. Um, that's a hard one. Um, maybe the support you know that you get from uh, once you're kind of once you're in. Um, it's not just just you anymore. Uh, you, you've got a support system helping and people believing in you um, uh, to help you kind of create the product that you want to produce. Um, not a not a whole lot of things that I love about the music industry, but but I do love music. So, what song or kind of music is your favorite to perform? Can you repeat the question? What song or kind of music is your favorite to perform? Mm, I don't have a favorite song to perform. Well, From Here right now is actually probably my favorite song to perform. Yes. And, uh, and anything soulful. Yeah. Anything that, that touches the heart and kind of makes you grit your teeth a little bit. And what is it about the song From Here that makes it so great to perform live? I would say just the pure raw emotion, the, uh, the, the beat, uh, the BPM, the beats per minute also is, is, is kind of uh, slow and, uh, and vibey. So I have, I have time to kind of really put my soul into that song when I perform it. What is your dream collaboration? If you could collaborate with any musician who's alive or maybe a musician who's passed on, who would it be and why? Oh gosh. All right, so if I had to choose one alive, I would definitely choose Omar Apollo uh, right now in this, in this state of life. Uh, if I had to choose someone that has passed away, um, I'd say Amy Winehouse for sure. Yeah, I mean, Amy, uh, or Jimi Hendrix. Amy Winehouse was a real terrific talent. What about her music stands out to you? Amy was another just completely raw uh, um, artist who, who um, you can you can hear the pain in her voice. You know, um, she's relatable. She's even on happy songs, you know, you can, you can relate. A good singer has to be able to relay that and, and relate um, through vocals. So. Can you share your social media links? So on Instagram, it's at Paulina Simone 19. Facebook is going to be Paulina Simone Music. I've got a YouTube channel. Go check that out. Um, the new single will be on there shortly and on all streaming platforms within the month hopefully now is there I anything can. else you'd like to promote or share I think 
um, I think this new single is, uh, yeah, that's kind of where my focus is right now. I'm working on a music video for it as well with uh, Garen Hyde um, of Hydeography. Um, uh, awesome guy. And uh, Jade, his fiance, is, is awesome as well. Can't wait to work with them on some visuals. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's definitely my focus right now. All right, I would like to give a very big thank you to my guests for joining me today on this Talk Ain't Cheap Radio. Now let's get into some more music. I wish I never fell in love with you. Mood melodies. Mood melodies. Cause I fear that my heart cannot handle getting emotional over you, girl. I wish I never fell in love. I wish I never fell in love I wish I never fell in love With you I knew from the start that you would steal my heart And I knew by the end that I would fall in love The second you spoke to me I was under your spell Here what have you done to me? Whatever you wanted, I gave it to you There was no limit to the things I would do Cause the way that I felt, I did it all for you Cause I could see nothing else Cause he can never please you and love you like I can All I wanted from you was tender love and care And how could you leave it like you never gave a damn About me, about me, baby They gon' get it for me. I had to hit a lick. They was they gon' hit it for me. I had 
to get that money. They wasn't gonna get it for me. I had to hit a lick. They wasn't gonna hit it for me. I had to get that money. They wasn't gonna get it for me. I had to hit a lick. They wasn't gonna hit it for me. Once upon a time, none of these bitches didn't want me. We ain't never on the same page, but that's a different story. What if right before them shots, my brother didn't call me? What if Beverly would have never did the numbers for me? She should have did my competition a favor, but mommy fucked up. Now these niggas can't get no paper. I'm flying in a saucer, but no alien. Hate to block my heart, cause it was failing me. What I could be without control, that shit be scaring me. I used to wonder why I was lonely, but now it's clear to me. You too aggressive, thoughts too expensive. I had million dollar dreams before I could spend them. But that's what made me who I am today, though. If my job Jones run out Sunday in the KO. When we lost Reese, I was sipping on Reese to wash down the yada. One of my brothers took my brother, and I ain't see him proper. Even with my bloods, I be in the cut so much, I need a doctor. I'm in all black, feel like a phantom, and this beats my opera. My voice here crying, but I ain't crying, it's just inside I'm dying. My niggas keep dying, I can't keep crying, I use that glizzy to dry him. I took my heart out, building a team, and put it all in the grinding. Your brother's shining, but when times get hard, you can't find him. Is that shit? I don't support Pop a nigga like a cork I'm known for tweaking And guns my beacon Geeking like a dog I caught the shots These niggas was throwing But it ain't getting to me I don't even write no more My fold and shoulders Be spitting through me I got a call About some little niggas Looking for me I was on probation Facing cases of blood that did it for me My mouth's tight Missing to do better Than they did before me Keep your lips still So you can tell A different story These rap niggas bore me Pussy niggas When he no horny I was sitting Rap shit for me That's why they can't ignore me I just touched 4G's off the 4G I was wearing blood back when we was wearing Maurice You was trying to get free I was trying to stay free I never fought, it's the only reason God be helping me That shine with Rolling Stone, so why they always pelting me? Uh, I had to get that money They wasn't gon' get it for me I had to hit a lick They wasn't gon' hit it for me Once upon a time, none of these bitches didn't want me We ain't never on the same page, but that's a different story now what if right before them shots my brother didn't call me? What if Beverly would've never did them numbers for me? She should've did my competition a favor, but mommy fucked up. Now these niggas can't get no paper. I'd like to thank you for tuning in. This has been another episode of This Talk Ain't Cheap Radio. If you have not already, please go to and subscribe to the YouTube channel. That is Ennis Productions on YouTube and Instagram. E-N-N-I-S Productions. And this Productions is your source for music, business, motivation, and support. And we also have the Creative Collective series, where we interview talented people and give them a chance to share their story. If you're a musician looking for help to take your career to the next level, contact Ennis Management and get real help and real results in growing your personal brand with your audience, learning how to effectively promote and market your music using social media, learning the business side of the music industry, and how to become your own booking agent. Contact Ennis Productions at gmail.com. Ennis Management, empowering musicians through education. If you would like to have your music played on This Talk Ain't Cheap Radio, simply email your music to ryancross020 at gmail.com. That is R-Y-A-N-C-R-O-S-S-020 at gmail.com. That's our show for today. We'll be back with another new episode tomorrow. I'm out.